Hello everybody. Today I will talk about transactions in SAP. They are very practical and you are very fast by using them. One or the other has certainly already thought about the meaning of the composition of these transactions. This is what I want to consider with this short video. SAP itself is divided into different modules. The best known and perhaps the ones with the greatest range are FI for financial, CO for controlling, MM materials management and SD for sales and distribution. For the explanation I will use a few transactions from the MM and SD area such as the VA01, ME21N, VF01 or LT01. You can see that the mostly consists of letters and numbers and today I want to reveal the meaning of them. In short, the letters indicate the area or the module and the numbers the activity. For example, create, change, delete and so on. Basically, transactions can be assigned to a module very easily. For example, the transaction F key 01 to create a vendor in the accounting module FE. Because of the first letter F, I know that it belongs to the module FI. Nevertheless, you may wonder why transactions from the sales and distribution module often start with the letter V. This is due to the history of SAP. SAP was developed in Germany and therefore it still has German terms in the name but also in the ABAP programming language. In former times the area of sales and distribution was called Vertrieb and therefore we still have the V for Vertrieb in the transactions. The German word Vertrieb means distribution in English. Other former terms were A, Auftrag, for order, L, the German word for Lieferung, delivery, F, Finanzbuchhaltung, financials, M, Materialbuchhaltung, material management, I, Einkauf, Purchasing, L, Logistics, T, Transport. And the numbers in the transaction describe the activity. 1 for add or create, 2 for change, 3 for display, 4 for print or process messages, and so on. And now I want to show uh, three examples. The first one is the transactions VA1. V stands for Vertrieb or Distribution, A for Order and 1 for Add or Create. So you can create a sales order with this transaction. The next one is the LT01. L for logistics, T for transport, and 1 for add or create. So with this transaction you can create a transfer order. The last transaction is the ME21N. M stands for material management, E for purchasing, ME2 for Purchase order, one for add or create, and the letter N stands here for new, which is also known from other transactions and means that there have been changes in design or function functionality. So, 
I hope the short video could now contribute something to the clarification about transactions in SAP. See you soon.